Hey guys, welcome back to Fishing Another. Fishing Another. Hi oh guys, welcome back to Fishing the LP with Jackson, Cole, and Noah. I wanted to do, this is me, a shorter video. This is how to fillet a fish. Um, I know there's a lot of people out there that probably catch fish and don't know how to fillet fish, so I wanted to do a quick video on how to fillet fish. I got into a little treat here on this lake. You don't catch these very often. Nice little perch. And we're going to fillet them up and have probably for lunch tomorrow. Cole's got a nice big bluegill. We got some other. I'm just going to do this one fish though for you guys. Alright, I'm going to readjust the camera and then I'll show you guys the fish. Hey guys, here again. Got the camera readjusted. I'm using my grandpa's nice Rapala fillet knife. And I can use Sorry. my uncle's. Yeah, he's using my dad's. Sorry about the lighting. It's we only have these yellow lights out here. It's kind of it's well as you can tell it's dark out. But I'm doing I'm getting this. I'm gonna first I'm going to cut right across here, and then I'm gonna flip it around. I'm gonna go right down the spine. I'm gonna come out here, and then I'm gonna take the meat off of here and drop it in the pail or the stuff over there. All right. You take the fin. You flip the fin up. And then you. You gotta take okay here. Flip up the fin. I like doing an angle cut because it gets you more meat in the end. I gotta find out where that, where the, there. Dang it! Come on. Having trouble, school? Uh, no. My fish just keeps on sliding. There we go. Right there. And yeah. Make what sure. The heck? What is wrong? Where is? That must be hitting bone or something. Oh yeah. Right, I forgot one thing about these perch is they have a skull that stick that's like super hard and what I was trying to cut. So I'm Make sure you're there. careful with your knife because I've cut myself really bad before. Man, what the heck? This thing was super sharp. I told you. Well, how did it get so dull? I don't know. I really know I used it on some. I didn't. Stuff he wasn't supposed to. Okay, well. So, you take this. I'm just going to flip it around and do it this way. Alright, I got it down like that. As you can see the cut, I'll show the camera. Cut right there. Freaking suck at this. And then you stick this right here by the back of the top of the cut. Sorry, I'm covering up the fish, but you go right down the back. Right down the spine. And then once you get down far enough, you'll be able to push the knife farther. And you stick the knife right there. Have it come out. Then you angle it down towards all the bones in the middle. And you just pull it all the way down until it slides out by the tail. So now you got your fillet halfway done. Now you just have to get, get it the rest of the way off the fish. So you take it and you flip it up by the spine and you just drag your knife down. So you can get it good, and then you start getting that nice flay that comes right off. Oh my god. Having trouble, Cole? And then you got, uh, you got it no. like that. I got it most, most of the way off, so I have that, and then I'm going to just slowly keep going, and then once you hit the rib cage, you got to angle your knife up a little bit, so you can keep it going you gotta angle it up so you go up right around dumb the rib you go up on the rib cage dumb spider eating my fish get off then once you get around the rib cage you got it well I have it most of the way around the rib cage you get it like that and then you can just keep on peeling away at that I'm gonna get this rest of the way off and I'll start the other side all right, most people just they don't go for some of the meat that I'm gonna go for but there's a good meat down in the down by the gut area if you cut down into the uh, Frick. Uh, organ having trouble cool sack and stuff you, you just you can peel off a bunch of the meat and then you have the stomach liner okay sorry if this is a little gruesome I'll put a warning at the beginning of the video see this shiny spot right there you can cut that out where the guts are right here and that's a whole bunch of extra meat right there that you can just cut off the flay along with it so that's 
pretty nice right there. That's a pretty good size. So I'll just cut that off right there. So then I got there's a there's a fillet of the fish right there. Now I'm gonna show you how to get the skin off. I did it! I did it! Are you off. cutting the ribs with it? Oh yeah. Why would you do that? Because you cut those off. Oh yeah. So oh, yeah, I'm just gonna take it. I put my oh, finger yeah. right here at the base. You can get uh, cutting boards that have clips on it. But you just slowly work your knife back and forth. It peels it and it peels it up and off. And you just keep going like that. And you just go and go and cut until you get it almost all the way. Or you get it all the way. And there you go. That is a fresh, perfect fillet of perch. I'm going to cook this up for lunch tomorrow. And have a good old time about it. Alright, thank you guys for watching this episode of Fishing the LP. I'm going to get on to filling the rest of this fish, and you guys are going to get on to having a good night. Alright, see ya.